heart of the book is an emphasis on quality of governance being the independent variable that determines how well countries, uh, and in this case globally, do respond to challenges of the kind of magnitude that the global pandemic represents. Authenticity of leadership is uh, really a very critical component in uh, achieving a kind of trust compact between the population and, and the government. These, the combination of these three things, sticking to a plan for too long, triggering the counter-cyclical measures, which, which exaggerated the risk, and third, not heeding warnings from outside the government, created a situation where we went from having 24 cases to 57,000 cases. The government should be credited for, uh, particularly uh, Prime Minister Lee Sen Lung, for being candid and accepting that there were errors and we will learn from them and we have learned from them. Uh, what it shows is that international institutions matter, multilateralism matters, because they create fora and platforms and frameworks for uh, coordination, for cooperation, uh, even between um, nations which otherwise may have animosities. But the virus doesn't respect borders and doesn't respect race, doesn't respect religion, doesn't respect political divides. And I don't think we're going to be returning to the previous state. First of all, the world, uh, not just in this near term, but over the last uh, four years, has learned to work without the United States. Um, and, uh, and despite the United States. The answer is uh, unfortunately going to be no. I don't think the United States is going to change its uh, one China policy. So Taiwan is, is uh, it's a geopolitical issue, not a public health issue. And the fact that it is done well in dealing with the coronavirus uh, it's not going to change that geopolitical condition 